out to me and you, Roger Lloyd Pack may have been known for his roles as an actor, many of them unforgettable. But to his family, he was a husband to Jeanne and a father to four. After losing Roger to cancer two years ago, his wife and son Hartley wanted to put their loss into words. And so together, they have created this album, 16 Sunsets, their own way of remembering Roger. The title of the album comes from the, the poem that I wrote about that day of diagnosis. And it's like my whole life changed really on that day. And I knew that, you know, now suddenly I had a time limit on it and it was so unlikely that he would survive it at that, at that time. That was one of the darkest days, I think. What do you think he would have thought of the album? <laughs> yeah, no, I think he, he, would have, he, he would have loved it. He would have just, he would have just appreciated the way we uh, use music and I think he would have really, 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 really been proud of it. Trig, why do you call me Dave? My name's not Dave. My name's Rodney. I thought it was Dave. No, it's Rodney. <laughs> you sure? No, I'm positive. As the deadpan and deliberately slow-witted trigger in Only Fools and Horses, Roger Lloyd Pack became one of Britain's most loved and laughed at characters. So I had to ask Hartley and Jan whether Roger ever felt trigger tagged along with him. Was it a blessing or a curse? He sort of realised that actually it had been an incredible help in our life in every way and that he, he sort of found a, a good way of dealing with it. Often up in Tottenham, sitting there and watching Lily White Boys. From trips to watch Tottenham Hotspur play to the day of Roger's diagnosis, the album makes up a collection of family memories. The money raised will go to Pancreatic Cancer UK. 16 Sunsets is released on Monday, which would have been the actor's 72nd birthday. I guess what, what I take from my dad is just, I don't know, it's a bit of a cliche, but just living life for the, for, to the most, just appreciating, appreciating what you've got. I think probably the fun we had, the fun we had together actually is how I'd like to remember him. You know, the little dodges we used to do, how we used to go to parties or, or working in the garden or going swimming on the, in the wild shores of Norfolk. Just, just the fun we had, I think. That's the best one. Right?